Hello champion, George Duart here from the Georgie Live Cooking Show. Today is May 6, 2019. Let's jump right in. Now you can see in the subject line, I have vegan tuna salad. So let's get right to it. So right now I'm going to go ahead and post this. Uh-oh. Russ Turner is watching. Well. Hey, what's up, Russ? I'm kind of pulsing that. You don't want to pulse it too much. Right? That's pretty good. Al Blomquist is watching. Hey, Al, what's up, brother? So what I did was I used some chickpeas. These are chickpeas, and I kind of pulsed them up a little bit. The, the little green stuff you see in there is is, uh, is some seaweed. What do they call this? Nori sheet, a nori sheet, part of a nori sheet. So don't, don't look alarmed. So what I'm going to do now, put this in here like that. And it's okay if that's got a few chunks in it. You don't want it to be like pulverized, right? You don't want it to be pulverized. It's a beautiful day outside today, guys. Go out and get some sun. Make sure you go out and get you some good, some, some good drinking water. Take some deep breaths. Your lungs will love you for it. This is going to be good right here, y'all. All right, boom, that's done. All right, so now we're gonna start putting this bad boy together. So I, before we started, I chopped up about a tablespoon of onion, of red onion. So I'm gonna put that in there, tablespoon or two. I'm gonna put that in there. I'm gonna put in about a half a celery stalk. stalk. It was frozen, so that's why you see all that water there. We're gonna we use that later, the, the avocado. I'm gonna take this nori sheet, it's kind of Blend it up. That kind of gives it that little bit of a fishy taste. All right. I'm going to put about a teaspoon of salt. I'm going to put just a splash, maybe an eighth of a teaspoon of celery seed. I'm going to do a little black pepper. I'm gonna do some garlic powder, some onion powder, and now I'm gonna add a little bit of. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a video on this. I made some homemade vegan. Cucumber mayo. So I'm putting this cucumber mayo in here. Gary Ray is watching. What's up, Gary, brother? How you doing, man? So I'm going to mix this all together. I'm going to mix this all together. You want to kind of like circle it, you know? Circle the wagons if it, as you will. And that, that green stuff that you're seeing is the, the nori sheet that kind of gives it that, that extra kind of sea flavor or, or taste. Eula Clarice Davis is watching. Eula, how you doing, champion? Welcome to the Georgie Cooking Show, live cooking show. We got, we got Windsor High representing today. Fire up. Windsor High alum, alumni, Gary Wright and Beulah. All right, now we got to taste this bad boy, see how, how it tastes. You got to see it. Hi, George, I'm good. Awesome, awesome. I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of George's, George's rub on there, too. Put that in there a little bit. This is going to be good. <laughs> Russ says, looks like cookie dough. Add some chocolate chips and go to town. Russ, you need to go sit down, man. Because we're not making cookies today. I'm a, I'll am let you know when I'm making cookies, man. That's a, one of the brothers that goes to church. He loves, he loves to eat cookies. 
me try this out right quick. Like this. Add a little bit more mayo. This is some vegan mayo. I'm gonna show you a rest. I'm gonna show you how I how I did that recipe with the cucumber mayo. Vegan cucumber mayo, that is. I think it needs just a little bit more black pepper. A little bit more black pepper. Bam. And we good now, though. Ooh, I didn't mean to get you, son. You be all right, though. You be all right. Real simple. Let's see how we, let's see how this is now. It's a little salty. You can hold back off, off, off the salt a little bit. It's delicious though. Mm. There you have it. You know what I'm gonna do too? I'm gonna put a little bit of Georgie's mildly hot barbecue sauce in it too. Beulah asks, are you vegan? Yes, ma'am. I went plant-based August of last year. I was 290 pounds. And I know something was getting ready to happen. I just felt like something was getting ready to happen to me physically. So I just made the decision. I didn't do it for my wife. I didn't do it for my son. I made a commitment to the Lord. I said, I gotta get healthy, man, because there's too many people around me that are dying from unwarranted diseases. So that's what I did. I went plant-based. What I did, Beulah, was I, the first three days I went on a water fast. All I did was water for three days. My taste buds changed amazingly. Where I was able to really know what food and flavor tastes like. And then after the three day water fast, I started going back to just eating plant-based foods. No dairy, no cheese. I cut out uh, refined sugars. No added oil, no added salt. Uh oh. And then I started going on an intermediate fast where I would eat for eight hours and fast for 16 hours. We have a couple of new viewers. We have Reggie Pope and Adam Bean. Adam, what's up, brother? What's up, Reggie? And then, you know, I just started, just, I just, it just felt so good that I kissed, I said, well, you know what? After 30 days, I probably shredded like 20 pounds or 15, about 15 pounds. So now I'm about 245. And then that, that, thir that first 30 days, I went to the doctor and had blood work done. All my, all my blood work was stellar. And it was like, you know what? I'm good now. So, but you know, people want to eat meat, you know, I'm going to do, so I'll do some, some uh, meat recipes as well. Because I still know how to cook meat, you know. It's all good. I love it. We have a new viewer. Who we got? Rhea Santos. Rhea! Let's take a picture, Rhea. <laughs> That's awesome. Mrs. Vasquez is watching also. Mrs. Vasquez. How you doing, champion? We got we got some we got some alumni from Windsor High from 1975, Reggie Pope, up until 70, I mean uh, 80 from uh to Gary and then 81. Bueller and I, it's awesome. So nuts and nuts and plenty of fruit, gallon of water every day, Bueller. And you know, mine was mine got really clear after the, that three day water fast, and my smell got intense, my hearing got intense, and I just said, you know what, I'm good. I'm good. So that's good right there. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this flatbread. 
Rhea oh. says, looking good, George. No pictures, please. <laughs> Thank you, Rhea. So what I'm doing now, I'm just gonna heat up these flat breads. I got the flat, flat iron going. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put, I'm dress it up on this plate. Jewel Wilson is watching also. Winds are high in the house. Hey, Jewel. So we got 75, 80, 81, and I believe with Jewel, 83, I believe you graduated. It's awesome. Then we got a Christian up, the other Christian brothers there. We got we got Adam, we got Beulah, we got Russ. Who else is out there? Mrs. Vasquez. Oh yeah, Mrs. Vasquez, yeah. Yeah. Nelly! Como estas? My son's over here begging for some. Begging for some of this. Boop. If you hit now, listen now. If you hear the smacking on the on the recording, you know why. Because mm -hmm. it's, it's from my son. So this bad boy is heating up right here. Ooh. That's hot right there. You're making a hot mess over here. Yeah. Yeah, that's hot right there. And now what we're gonna do, we're gonna do the finished product. I never, I'll never forget, we were down visiting my, my uncle down in Mississippi and his wife and my aunt. And uh, my son asked at the time when he was alive, he asked him, uh, cause he had had a stroke and, but he was still like awesome, Uncle, uncle Percy was awesome. And he had uh, a little trouble kind of walking a little bit cause he had, he had the stroke. And so, my son asked him, like, uh, Uncle Percy, how you feeling? And with his witty self, because he couldn't really hardly talk, you know, that much, he would say, with my hands, with my hands. And we all fell out laughing. And, there was, you know, that was just like a, a real fond memory that we got when, you know, you know, you got a little kid asking, you know, asking a sincere question. And here comes Uncle Percy, that he slide that in there. With my hands, with my hands. It was funny. It was awesome. That was awesome. All right, guys. These bad boys is hot. All right, so we're going to dress these up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on this, put on a little bit of some arugula. Mr. Turner says, looks like pancakes, George. <laughs> you always trying to get some pancakes or something, man. I'm going to put some arugula and... Uh, Baby spinach on here, right? I'm gonna take some of this mayo. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do it this way. No, it's not over there, but we'll do it this way. We'll do it this way. We'll do it this way. Put a little bit more in that other one over there. So guess what? My son's gonna want. To, he's gonna want to have. He's gonna want to have some of this. So I'm gonna take these bad boys like this. Put that on there, like that. Some avocado. And this is a nice. A lot of protein in here. It smells absolutely divine. And that's it, guys, right there. A, this is now this is a, a meal for a king or a queen. And it smells delicious. That that green stuff that you see is I used a little bit of the uh, nori sheets or seaweed to blend it up to kind of give it that little bit more of a flavor from from the uh, from the sea. So this is it. Awesome meal. Real quick to make, real simple. Tina Price is watching. Hey, Tina, how you doing, champion? Tina, do you know, uh, Tina and Beulah, do you guys know each other? Are you guys close to each other? I know you're in Houston, right, uh, Beulah? Where about are you, uh, Tina, in, in, in Texas? Because she's a classmate. Beulah is a classmate of mine, and she's in Texas. I believe she's in the Houston area. Where are you, uh, Tina? But this is this is real simple meal, and it's awesome. So... With that said, 
we're going we're gonna to let you guys go. We appreciate you guys stopping in with us. Adam, Reggie, Beulah, Gary, Miss uh, Nelly. She's from Houston. Oh, she's in Houston too? And, um, and uh, Tina from and Clear Lake. Oh, I know she's, yeah, she's in Houston. Uh, uh, Reggie, uh, Nelly, Beulah, Adam, Gary, Jewel. Did I get everybody? Mm -hmm. I apologize if I forgot any of you, you guys. But thank you guys for watching. Listen, make sure you find out how you can get tied into the world of Georgie's live cooking shows. We do them every day. And by you going to www.sauceforme.com, put your name and email in, I'll send you out an email every day when we're getting ready to go live so you, you, can, you can jump on. What you wiggling with the camera for? What you trying to do, man? What you trying to do? Come on, Wiggles. Wiggle, wiggle while you work. <laughs> All right, so uh, make sure you go to www.saucerme.com. Put your name and email in. You'll get seven free recipes for doing that. And also you'll get tied into the world of, excuse me, you'll get tied into the world of Georgie's all-purpose barbecue sauce. We have the, this is, we have the Miley Hot here, uh, which is, has a little bit of kick. We have here also the Mangalicious, that's sweet and spicy. The ladies like the Mangalicious for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it's the mango. But the ladies love the Mangalicious. And I also have original family friendly and really hot. We just, we're going to be rolling out our all purpose rub. We just got approved. We just approved a few days back. We approved the labels. So we'll be going to be uh, launching that in a couple of days. Stay right where you are. Stay right where you are. You guys are going to get a sneak peek. Stay right where you are. You're going to get a sneak peek of what the label is going to look like. Are you guys ready? Are you 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 ready? This is a sneak peek, a sneak peek, say that three times fast, a sneak peek of what the labels look like. This is a sneak peek. Ready? Say you're ready. I want you guys to type in, I'm ready, because I'm not going to show it until you do it. Not going to show it. Oot. Not going to show it. Anybody say, it? I'm ready? I'm ready? Not yet. We're waiting on that. Anybody say, I'm ready? Can y'all see that? Bueller says, I'm ready. All right. Anybody else out there? Are they ready? Russ says he's ready. All right. Come on now. Come on now. Play the game now. Come on now. Tina says I'm ready. All right. Give me one more. I need one more. Come on, Adam. Give me say I'm ready now. Come on. I'm ready. Or Nelly. I know y'all probably can't type on the phone, the fancy phones or something. I'm ready. You ready? Bam. Sneak peek. All gone. That's what it looks like. Rest that's chop chop. That's <laughs> that's that's what it looks like. So that was a sneak peek, guys. So check this out. Find out how you can pre-order Georgie's all-purpose rub by going to www.sauceforme.com. Again, put your name and email in. You get seven free recipes. Plus, you'll be tied into the world of Georgie's live cooking shows. Georgie's all-purpose barbecue sauce, Georgie's rubs, and all the products and services that we offer. Because guess what? We're changing people's lives one taste bud at a time. So, guys, thanks again. My name is George Duhart from Georgie's BBQ Sauce, LLC. This is Georgie's live cooking show. Until tomorrow, fire it up. God bless, guys. Thank you. Fire it up.